Hey everyone, welcome back to John's Watch. Today I'm taking a look at a new game called Tender Creature Comforts. This game was released on Steam on May 28th, 2021. Its regular price is $9.99 US or your regional equivalent, and it's developed by developed and published by Kenny Sun, Gideon Lazarus, and G. N. Lee. Now this is a another one of those really cool games that's told basically like through a phone app, like a smartphone app. And this game is also available on uh, definitely Google, I believe it's available on iOS as well. Um, but as you might be able to guess from the name Tender, it's it, it's kind of like a, a spoof on Tinder, but you're not limited to um, just, just other humans, as you might guess from the second part of the title, Creature Comforts. Uh, it just sounds very cool. I always, I, I really like these phone games on PC. Um, I'd be interested in looking at the, the mobile version as well. So I'm gonna call myself John, confirm. Enter your birthday. I'm not going to enter my actual birthday. Let's make it today and see what happens. I'm going to date this recording, but uh, it is that. We'll go for 1969. Perfect. Okay. Oh, <laughs> these are very cool. I quite like that one. I like him doing like the little like peace sign, but I like that one. Create my profile. Okay. John, 52. Yeah, that's that's me. Uh, okay, so, sweatpants are better than any other pants. I've been wearing sweatpants for a long time now. <laughs> Care a lot about my work? No, I don't think that's true. <laughs> Get a lot of bruises I can't account for? No. You come to the fork in the road, take out sweatpants, definitely. Rewatching The Office again? Holy shit. I, um, I literally just watched the episode of The Office with, uh, with lunch. Um, so, yeah, I guess it's gotta be that. As, as fucking basic as that is, rewatching The Office, I, I, um, I needed to binge a lot of stuff, uh, and I had surgery over Christmas, so, um, The Office just seemed good, you know, nice and familiar and easy to watch. So I'm still, still just kinda watching it until it gets shit. No Geminis, don't, don't believe in that stuff. I'll beat you in Monopoly, I do fucking like Monopoly, I'm pretty good at it too. My sign is danger of falling rocks ahead. Not here to match, please swipe left. Yeah, definitely the Monopoly one. There. I mean, that's that's pretty good. I like that. That's my profile. Doesn't say anything. Oh my god, I got a message already. This is um, absolutely not how these things usually go. <laughs> uh, swipe right to like someone, swipe left to reject. Okay. Matches like you back, they'll appear on the matches screen. You've got one waiting for you right now. Uh... So we've got, this is me. <laughs> I look very cool. Uh, and then this is our matches and this is our messages. What's this bit? Oh, one, two, don't know what that means. We've got the settings here. Ah, dark mode. Oh God, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> oh my God. In, um, in the chat options, I do normally capitalize sentences. That's so cool that you can make it type like you do. Uh, I normally do not abbreviate words, that's true. I'm always using apostrophes correctly, absolutely. I use commas, yeah. Pick your favorites. I use haha -ha a lot. Um, and I use lol, I guess. My god. Do you think this... Has this program, like, infiltrated my computer already? <laughs> Seems to know me pretty well. Um, I do use these these crying laughing ones, actually. I use ha ha ha, so there we go, we'll go for that one. Oh, I can have lol lol as well if I want. I sometimes use LMAO, but only um, only lowercase. So we'll put that on there as well. Uh, I use OMG sometimes, and wow, and ah. Um, I don't use, I don't, I don't really use any of these. Bah, grr. <laughs> maybe, maybe ugh, that would be it. I love that you can customize this, this is great. Uh, yeah, thank you and thanks, yeah, those are good. Sweet, I love that. Okay, let's go to my match with Annie. Hello, Annie. Hey there, John. Welcome to the Tender system. Oh, great. She's a she's a, a bot or an admin or something. Um, help with what? <laughs> oh, she's typing. Can you date, silly? Okay, cool. Cool your jets, girl. Jesus, this is actually the right time as well. So. I'm glad this would have dated the video anyway. Uh, I see you have your profile already. Let's complete the rest of your visa application. Can you tell me what you brought? What brought you to come for ticks? What is that? Is that the the app? I'm guessing yes. Oh, I just looked further down on the um, 
Steam page and it says content warning, toxic relationships will probably be okay in this video. Uh, but just in case. Recently broke up with my partner. My partner and I broke up. It was mutual. My partner dumped me. We'll say it was mutual. God, I can't relate to this at all right now. <laughs> no reason to lie here, John. It's never mutual. Someone always leaves. What's your ex-partner's name? Jeez. Enter their name. God, do I really have to do this? Here we go. Female name generator. <laughs> just, uh, just one name, please. Go. Betty. Perfect. Enter their name. Betty. Betty. It was Betty. Why do you need to know this, Annie? So you don't match me with someone called Betty? Thank you for sharing. Let's take a moment to say goodbye to Betty. <laughs> Great, now you need to get back out there. What are you looking for? Uh, another Betty. <laughs> need to find love again, casual dating or hookups. Uh, this man. This 52-year-old man. This 52-year-old version of me. Who just got dumped by Betty wants to find love again. He's ready for it. I love how aggressively he types as well. <laughs> The tender dating community is perfect for you then. Great. Your visa has been approved and you're cleared for dating. Oh, great. Can I go to see that? Nope. Uh, what is my visa? Go. On your stay at Comfortix, you've been approved for 10 dates. That means after 10 dates, you'll be allowed to finish your conversations, but no more swiping your dates. Hopefully you found what you wanted by then. Goodness. Happy hunting. Stay chill and let me know if you have any more questions. Okay, thanks. I'm gonna slay. <laughs> okay, you can ask Annie out. Um, let's see. Roger that. Thumbs up. Ooh. That one. Definitely that one. Oh, she's gonna answer. Go get swiping. Um. Okay, thanks. So I can talk to her again later if I want. Let's go get swiping. Courtney. Busy mom slash dad. Is that... Oh, that's cool. So yeah, it does say on the, the store page that it's written by Gideon Lazarus, the art's by Qian Li, and it's programmed by Kenny Sun. Cool. Um, is that all you've got? Is your mom dad? No, I'm a single 52-year-old man. Uh, nope. Carl. Doesn't have a profile picture. Lover of sci-fi, pulp, and pop culture. Sliding between Dancing with the Devil and Dancing with Bob Ross. Sorry, Carl, I'm not, not super into sci-fi. Or pulp, or pop culture. Get out of here, Carl. Wait, get out of here. Whoa! 54, it looked very good for 54. Love good books, wordy books, and tired books. Sure don't tell, be bright. Okay, Abby, swipe. Did we get a match? Abby? <laughs> Abby? <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh, Jackie, just shrugging. You know, I, I like your, your overcoat and your tail, I guess. Um, and you also look very good, very punky for 60, but got to put more effort into your, your bio than that, Jackie. Get out of here. Bertram. Oh, communications grad. At 54, well done, Bertram. Got my first advertising gig. Lonely replicant looking for someone to mold to. Is that a winky face? No, it's just a normal smiley face, but you seem okay. Whoa, Jeffrey. A big clam thing. Oh, Bertram liked me, I think. I have trouble opening up. Well, I like you, buddy. Swipe on that. We got a match with Bertram. Holy crap. Unmatch. <laughs> um, let's, can we see Bertram's profile again? There. Very, very cute. It's got to be said. Uh, let's, what do we want to say? What's going on, Bertram? How you doing, buddy? Oh my god, an instant reply? Not much lying in bed procrastinating you. Wait, aren't you a fucking communications grad? That's how you communicate? Um... <laughs> I, I don't like that, uh, that tongue, tongue emoji here. Recently arrived here, so I'm still getting the lay of the land. That seems fine. I don't know if you'd want to say, like, oh, I've just started online dating, lol. But, um, John, born in 1969, would say that. Glad you made it. We're a pretty chill planet. Ah, gone on any dates yet? <laughs> I've gone around. I was, I was expecting there to be, like, a nope. Do you want to be my first winky face? Um, haven't got any. I'm certainly hoping to, Bertram. 
Brody. Oh, Abby likes me back. Which one was Abby? Abby was not the um the big clam. So, you know. Um we'll, we'll do that one. That's fine. I try and use actual emojis now. Okay, hold on. Abby. Oh, she likes the books and stuff, right? Yes. Hi, jo Hi there, John. Uh, hi, Abby. What's up? I, w I would, I would add her name, you know. Be a bit more polite. Oh, she's answering right away. And she have a knitting project I was working on. That's cool. What did you study in college? It was art. That's that's all you're gonna say? God, this man is not going to. This version of John is not going to get many dates. Maybe he will. I mean, this is what I've been doing wrong. <laughs> what was your focus? English. Well, I mean, none of these, but I do video editing. And I guess I make thumbnails, just not very well. So we can say that. Sorry, I'll be back. Um, hang on, Abby. Let me just, let me see if, let, let me swipe on, on one more person, Paula. Got eight eyes, but I'm only looking for the one. Eh, uh, maybe. Aaliyah. Plant-based Libra. I have a cat. His name is Chairman Meow. You two better get along. I like cats. There we go. Whoa, Jeremy. He's um he's a family man though, and this version of John is not. So sorry, Jeremy. What a face though on Gwen. Are she checks out dead things on the street. No, I don't think so. Whoa. Lonely Kawaii Neko searching for full human to love and adore. Just a, a little creepy. I love, love that he's used um, an emoji to cover up other people's faces. So um, when I went to Japan, I did actually like go on Tinder when I was there, and this happened so much. It would be like a girl in the middle and like surrounded by like her friends, and they'd all have like emojis covering like all of them. Just like I'd never seen that before in North America, but you see it all the time in Japan. <laughs> it's very funny. Whoa! Oh, you can eat sushi. Yes, Marina. Uh, nifty. Okay, now we gotta now we gotta ask her a question. How about you? I feel like we almost fucked up this Abby match already. Let's go talk to Bertram. Uh, I'd be open to showing you around, but I don't think this is serious. I'm mostly bored. Oh, sorry. I'm looking for serious. Uh, we could say I'd really appreciate that, I guess. But I'm looking for for something more Bertie. Should be free sometime this week and we can see where it goes from there. Wow, we got a date already, basically. It's gonna be somewhere good, winky face. Oh, it wasn't an actual winky face. Go on a date with Bertram. Do we do it right now? Okay. You have a date scheduled with Bertram. Great, let's do it. Let's see what our date's like. I meet Bertram downtown in an area they said have a lot of good spots. Bertram comes up to me. Uh, no, it's a bit too soon. Maybe at the end of the date we could do a hug. Reach out my hand. Bertram urges me away. I don't do physical contact for your own protection. I give two thumbs up. They gesture broadly. Welcome to Comfortix. If your dating goes well, you won't be here long. Thank you, that's what I'm hoping for. Should we start with food or sightseeing? Maybe sightseeing first. There's a musty fountain nearby. I follow Bertram. <laughs> this is so cool. The weather's warm and breezy. A crowd of people move towards us. Um, yes, we, we've only known each other, and I'm not supposed to touch him. I separate to let them pass between us. Bertram tries to follow me and gets bumped. No! Bertram, crowded today. They shrug. Are you a big walker? Uh, sure. <laughs> I don't have many options in this date. It's my only exercise. We arrive at a tall fountain. I stick my hand in the spray. It kills me. You're dead. This is a wishing fountain. Bertrand gives me a coin. Oh. I put the coin. <laughs> no. I toss the coin in. I wish to find love. I wish I was content being alone. It's fucking awesome, dude. You'll you'll get there, um, 52 year old John. I mean maybe maybe you don't. Maybe he he loses it between uh my current age and 52. <laughs> 
Uh, I wish for more tender matches. Bertrand throws a coin in. My wish is to know whether this date will go anywhere. <laughs> I laugh loudly. Next. Bertram starts walking. I walk along beside them. Over here, we have a statue of Dave, who built Tender. <laughs> is Dave still around? <laughs> nope, Dave found a date and left. Oh, good for him. Very nice. How's life going here so far? Um, it's exciting. There's so many available people to meet. One down. Is there something specific you miss about Earth? Uh, the abundance of oxygen. <laughs> I haven't made you feel homesick, have I? Not at all. He's used to it, 52-year-old John. Good. Let's keep moving. I follow them. That's where I went to school. Bertram points across the street. It was a small school, a few thousand of us. They have schools here. I thought this was a dating planet or something. There's a whole functioning society to support tender daters. I'll take you to this lovely park. It'll have trees, which you probably like. I do like trees, sure. <laughs> trees, I'm... Ambivalent towards trees. We start walking towards the park. It's generally pretty nice out. I go out on a lot of park dates. I like park dates too. Wouldn't say love, but you know, they're they're fine. Absolutely love lying in the sun. Yes, absolutely. Sometimes. But only if you have sunscreen, yes. Correct. I was just gonna say that actually. We arrive at the park. This is called Greenwalk Park. Seems a little on the nose. <laughs> Bertram lies down. He doesn't have much of a sense of humor, does old Bertie, does he? Uh, I lay in a patch of sun next to Bertram. They make no move towards me. What do you think that cloud looks like? They point in the distance. It's a jellyfish. I was going to say it looks like condensation of water in the atmosphere. We continue lying down. Uh, I spread my arms. I touch Bertram. I die. I will turn over. Bertram stands up. I enjoyed meeting you, John. I give a cute smile as 52-year-old spaceman. Me too, I appreciate this. I have to head out, but I wish you the best luck in your future dates. Give him a goodbye wave. Bertram walks off. I depart. Well, that was a nice intro date. Um, he doesn't seem to have a ton of personality, though, old Bertie. Uh, but that was nice, I guess. We could message him, I think. Yeah, we can. I'll say thanks so much for showing me around. I'll do that one. Oh, he's still gonna respond. So you could go on another date with him, maybe. Uh, what'd Danny say? Go get a swipe. Oh, nice job, John. First date, Dan. Remember, your visa here only allows 10 dates. Find what you're looking for. After 10, you have to leave and reapply for a return visit. Interesting. I'm excited to go on more. Boink. I like that you can talk to this, this bot, or whoever she is. She has a profile. You could actually match with her. I bet there's an achievement for like, go, uh, like dating Annie. Oh, I got a match with Leah. Neat. Where's Abby? There's Abby. So literature, but can't get the full-time relevant job I want. Writing isn't everything and nobody cares. God, right you are, Abby. Um, okay, well, that is going to do it for this video. I really like this. Like I said, I, I really like um, just any game that like mimics a like a phone interface like um i loved the the emily's away games which didn't do a phone interface but a similar sort of concept and things like reins and stuff are, are pretty cool but um <laughs> this is neat I, I quite like this i think i might pick up the the google the android version and and play that but there you go that was a look at tender creature comforts on a pc thank you guys very much for watching make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys later. Bye.